dear students i welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics i am solving the problems from the book digital design by morris mano and michael cileti so in this video i am solving the problem number 6.8 from the chapter number 6 the problem is the serial adder of figure 6.5 this figure is from inside of the chapter uses two four bit resistors so this is the figure 6.5 okay this is a serial adder circuit so here we have two resistors shift resistor a and shift resistor b here we can see that for this resistor the serial input is feedback from the output of this full adder circuit that is the sum output is feedback here at the serial input and for the second resistor the serial output is feedback in the serial input and here we have this full adder circuit so here we have the sum output and here we have the carry output this carry output is feedback through a d flip flop okay so this is a d flip flop now we are given that the resistor a holds the binary number 0101 that means initially we have the content of the resistor a is 0101 and the content of the resistor b is 0111 now we are given that the carry flip flop is initially reset to 0 that means initially the carry is 0 now we have to find out or we have to make the list of binary values of resistor A and resistor B and carry flip flop after each shift that means after each shift means after each clock pulse there will be a shift at the resistor outputs so we have to list the binary values of resistor A and resistor B and the carry flip flop after each shift that means we have to find out the content of the resistor A after each shift content of the resistor B after each shift and carry output after each shift so let us find out the content of the resistor A, resistor B and carry in. So we are given that the content of the resistor A at the first step is 0101. Okay, and the content of the resistor B is 0111. These are as per the question. Okay, and the carry input is reset to 0. Okay, so we'll write here 0. For the circuit, content of the shift resistor will be modified with this sum output. So first of all, we are given with the content of this resistor. That is content of the resistor A is this one, content of the resistor B is this, this much and the carry in is firstly reset. Okay, now we have to find out the sum. For finding out the sum, we have to add the rightmost bit that is the serial out will be the rightmost bit. Okay, and this rightmost bit from resistor B and the carry in. Then we will get the sum and this carry output will be the next carry in. So, 1 plus 1 plus 0, this carry in is 0, okay, the sum will be 0 and the carry in will be 1. Now, let us find out the content of the resistor A after the first clock cycle. This sum will come to the MSB of resistor A because here we can see that this sum is feedback to the serial input of this shift resistor A. So, this 0 will come to the MSB of this resistor A to the leftmost bit and this bit will be shifted towards right because it is shift register okay so we'll have 0 1 0 and for register b we can see that the serial output is feedback to the serial out in so this one will feedback towards the left okay this so this one will come here okay and this bit will be shifted towards right 0 1 1 now we have to find out the sum and the carry so the sum will be 0 plus 1 plus 1 so the sum will be 0 and the carry is 1 now the content of the register a will be modified with this 0 so we'll have here 0 0 0 1 and the content of the register b will be 1 1 0 1 okay now we have got the carry input this one is the x and this is y okay so 1 plus 1 plus 1 the sum will be 1 and the carry is also 1. This 1 will be input here. So 1, 0, 0, 0 and this will be 1, 1, 1, 0 because 1 will enter here and these 3 bits will be shifted towards right. Okay. So for this now we have to find out the sum and carry. So here we will have 0 plus 0 plus 1. So sum is 1 and the carry is 0. And the content of the register A will be 1 will come here. Okay, so 1, 1, 0, 0. And for register B, we'll have this 0 will be feedback 0, 1, 1, 1. And the sum will be 0 plus 1 plus 0. So it will be 1 and the carry will be 
zero. So up to here we have to see. So as per the question, we have to list the values of the register A, register B, and the carry flip flop after each shift. So the content of the register A, content of a register A will be zero zero one zero. 0, 0, 1, 0. So after the second clock cycle, we will have 0, 0, 0, 1. Okay, after the third clock cycle, we will have 1, 0, 0, 0. And after the fourth clock cycle, we will have 1, 1, 0, 0. So content of the register B will be 1, 0, 1, 1. Next, we have 1, 1, 0, 1. Next, we have 1, 1, 1, 0. And 0 1 1 1 and so content of carry C will be 1 1 1 and 0 so this is the solution of the problem number 6.8 thank you for watching if you have any question please put it in the comment section below also like share and subscribe to my channel thank you